Let's take a look at how to set up the Sage HR Sage 50 integration. From your Sage 50 payroll, click on Online Services. Then select Online Service Settings from your Task Options. This will allow you to view a list of options that you can use to set up and manage your online services. Start by signing into your online services using your Sage account details. Here you can log in with your existing Sage account details or click Create Account to create one. At this stage, it's best to use a generic email, so admin at sage.com, for example. If you are creating an account, you will need to verify your email address using a verification code. This will be emailed to the address you used when creating your account. Once you've signed in, the next step is to register your payroll software for online services. The system will then register Sage HR for use with online services. Once the registration is successful, you can complete the remaining tasks. Click on option three to manage access to your online services. Here you can manage payroll users access rights. You can add new users or manage existing users. The next step is to manage your employees. Enter a unique email for each employee that corresponds to the email they have in Sage HR. You can also enter email addresses via the employee record in the analysis tab. Once all the emails have been captured, click save. You can then choose to upload pay slips for previous pay periods. Select the date range for the pay slips you want to have uploaded and then click Next to select employees. Select your employees and then click Next to publish pay slips. When your pay slips have been published, you will receive a message to let you know that they have been successfully published. You can then go to Sage HR by clicking on Go to Portal. From here, log in to your Sage HR account. Here, you can view your published payslips by navigating to the payslips menu option. Here you will see a summary of the payslips that have been published. You can view your pay information by clicking into the payslip. And you also, of course, have the option to download your payslip as a PDF.